A heartbreaking discovery on the Treasure Coast as the search for a teenager swept out to sea has come to an end. Nick Alensi's body was found just this morning, about 24 hours after the St. Lucie West student disappeared while he was swimming in the ocean right off Jensen Beach. Sheriff's deputy said Nick went into the water right around sunrise Monday. One day later, his body was found five miles south at Bathtub Beach. WPTV News Channel 5's Kate Hussey was there as the search came to an end. Chief Deputy John Budenseek says crews found Nick Alinsky just up the beach from where I'm standing. And while it's a heartbreaking end to a more than 24 hour long search, it means his family finally has an answer. With helicopters overhead, and boats on the water. Richard Alinsky and his aunt Elda stand at the edge of the ocean, watching, waiting for any glimmer of hope. I don't think we can describe the emotions that we are enduring, that we are harboring right now. They wait for his brother, her nephew, St. Lucie West student Nick Alinsky. Food deputies say was swept out to sea during rough waves Monday morning. The search to bring him home lasting through the night. Each crashing wave splintering the hope they try so hard to hold on to. This is the worst nightmare. This is a dream that we're hoping that we will wake up from. Their nightmare ending finally Tuesday morning at Bathtub Beach, five miles south from where it began. Right here behind where we're currently standing. Martin County's Chief Deputy John Budenseek says rescue crews found the 17-year-old's body in the water more than 24 hours after he dove in. While deputies can't confirm a rip current swept him out to sea, they say it is a possibility. Just the emotional roller coaster could be, it's just traumatic. And I, again, we empathize and sympathize with them and we're keeping the family in our thoughts and prayers. And as his family walks arm in arm, that reality sinks in. The brother, the son, the nephew, they say, was so thoughtful, so hardworking, the pillar in light to those around him won't be coming home. This is a tragedy. This is a, a drama. This is a reality that this family is dealing with. And we want the public to be a part of it. Nick could have been your son, your daughter. But as crews clear out, closure at least can set in. Not the answer they wanted, but an answer nonetheless. I think being here giving us that hope is nearer. We're near, we're near Nick. In Martin County, Kate Hussey, WPTV News Channel 5.